Today is National Creme Brulee Day. <laughs> the popular dessert is also known as burnt cream and trinity cream. And we have a unique recipe you can make at home. We have chef consultant Rob Keller here with his dish, which, which also celebrates National Scotch Day. So many yeah. national days rolled together in one. All right. You can make this at home. I would never think that. I wouldn't yes, even think you could buy it in a actually. store. You have to no, go to a restaurant. In a, in a commercial kitchen. And here we go. Is it out? No. Do we have a there's fire extinguisher safety? handy? Yeah, there's a safety. For when there you go. this happens. There Sweet. You go. Now you gotta twist <laughs> it off though. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I should stop You're playing with fire. Go up in flames. <laughs> well, I thought I would do uh, both creme brulee and also um, recognize scotch. Something with scotch. Yeah. Goes so, down in my belly. Um, I <clears throat> what I did is a butternut scotch creme brulee. Instead wow. of butternut squash. Yeah, so I went out and just got one single butternut squash. You can see I uh, halved it lengthwise, baked it off. What does baked it off mean? Um, oven 350 till soft. I could do that. Till soft. Oh, it is soft. Hmm. Yeah. That's kind of fun. <laughs> <laughs> and then what'd you do? Well, so once it's done, it. it comes out actually in a pulp. Here, I can show you. Okay. Um, you've got. <clears throat> So you're just basically gutting it? Yeah, you just gut it. And that leaves place for the other stuff? Now you can put it in a food processor and process it more. Some people like it a little pulpy, and they will literally put it into their cream at that point. I also have some eggs and sugar. You're going to have to mix both. I usually say equal parts. You don't need a blender for any of this, do you? Just a little whisk? Just a little whisk. Now, I did bring in an immersion blender just to show off that if you have one, you can easily incorporate all of this together with uh, something like this. Oh, I have one That's of those too. one toy that Scott has. Yeah. A, do you have a, a mini blowtorch? Yeah, I think I do. Holding? By the way, our pushy producer says you only have a minute left. Sorry about that. It's my fault. That's fine. <laughs> Anyways, what I do is I combine it. Okay. Um, I put in a little cinnamon. I put in a little vanilla. I actually put the real vanilla bean. Okay. And then grated cinnamon in there. Okay. Brought this up to a boil. Lower it. Incorporate it with your egg. And How long get, does this all take? This is what you have. Yeah. How long does this all take? Just About curious. 15 minutes to get That's to it? this point. Even for somebody like me? For the experts, maybe, but not for work. us. Well, at this point, you still need to bake it off. Okay. Do How long does match? that take? And I put it in a 350 oven uh, for about. 25 minutes in a water bath, just like this with a little bit of water. All right. When it comes out, it should be set. You just put a little water in there like that and just set it in your oven. That's this all. looks like a fun recipe, too. You yeah. know what I mean? Like you're having fun doing it. So when you're done, you got 30 seconds. You got to torch it. Oh, so. here you go. I'm gonna so you put the sugar on top. I'm going to step back over here a little bit. Sugar on top. Got to turn it all the way on. Oh, all the way on. There you go. There you go. Notice he doesn't let me do it. No, he grabbed that right out of your hand. <laughs> yep. Torch it on up. Get it nice and caramelized. Wow. And now yeah, don't eat the one that's Scott boiling has, hot. <laughs> Scott has his own spoon at his desk. You and read yes, this while I, I do talk. Have spoons. All right. Rob is a chef consultant. For more information about him or this delicious recipe, just head to fox59.com. Oh, ah, really good. Excellent. Yeah, there you go. Need, let me feed you. Oh, oh wow. You need to chase it with a shot. Oh, I do? That's not a good idea. Oh, this is, by the way, non-alcoholic mm. scotch. That is really good. No, it's not. <laughs> All right, your time right now is 648. <laughs>